Hello everyone, how are you all? Hope everything is well. Welcome back to Building Resilience in Children. Now today we are going to look into a little bit of a different topic, which is Teacher Appreciation Week. Now those of you who are new to the channel, um, just for you guys, so you know um, what we are doing on this channel, we do workshops with schools, with parents, with children, in different areas, of course, um, collecting data, and then we are trying to bring those stories back to you guys. Um, so the discussions, sometimes, sometimes um, we have um, collected some of the worries that people have. And what we are trying to do is to not really respond to. What we are doing here is having a little discussion around uh, how we can improve ways that we can do things differently. So we look into those. Now, Today, actually, um, this one is not particularly from a workshop, but this is something that I think um, we should all um, celebrate, which is our teachers. We need to celebrate our teachers for many different reasons. Of course, if you um, ask your child um, the time that they spend in school um, doing huge work, of course, you know, not many bring back some homework um, at home, but mostly they do it in school, but they're learning a lot. And that doesn't happen all of a sudden. A lot of effort actually goes into it. And I think we should all show our gratitude towards the teachers who are actually making this happen in the classroom. Now let's delve into a little bit deeper and kind of trying to understand where this teacher appreciation week concept came from, what happens in UK and all of that. So in UK, Teacher Appreciation Week does not have a specific designated week or date. Unlike some other countries, such as um, in the States, uh, where Teacher Appreciation Week is celebrated during the first full week of May. The UK does not have a nationally recognized Teacher Appreciation Week. Now hold on, that's where parents can actually put forward and raise their voices and say, well, we need it really for our teachers. Now, there are various initiatives, of course, and events throughout the year in the UK that aim to appreciate and recognize the efforts of teachers. Now, if you ask me that, do we need a week or two weeks or a month to actually celebrate? Well, it is not just that you are celebrating that, but you are, it, it, it stands as a reminder, a continuous reminder um, that um, their efforts needs to be recognized and appreciated. And we are really thankful um, for the amount of uh, teaching that happens in the school. Now, these initiatives are often organized by educational institutions, communities and charities, of course, in UK throughout the year. But think about it. Wouldn't it be wonderful to celebrate the hard work of our teachers? It's best to celebrate all the year, of course, but a reminder in May would be great or maybe some other time. What matters is that we remind ourselves of the hard work that teachers put in every day for our children. So one notable event, of course, in UK is the annual Pearson National Teaching Awards, which celebrate exceptional teachers and educators. While it is not a specific week dedicated to teacher appreciation, the awards do highlight the outstanding contributions of teachers across the country. Now, of course, you know, many people ask this question, well, if you are putting in awards and then some people get awards and some others doesn't, then is that equal? Well, that's, that's a different question and that's a different debate. Possibly we can take up later on but not for this one. So it's important to note that appreciation for teachers can be shown throughout the year, of course, and there may be some localized efforts or school-specific events to honor and appreciate teachers in the UK. If you're specifically looking for events or initiatives in your area, it would be best to check with the local schools, though, or educational organizations or community groups for information on teacher appreciation activities, if there are please do join. Now, the Teacher Appreciation Week, of course, is a designated period during which teachers are recognized and celebrated for their contributions and dedication to education. 
It is typically observed in many countries, including the States, as I mentioned previously, during the first full week of May. The purpose of this week is to express gratitude and honor the important role that teachers play in shaping the lives of students and society as a whole. During Teacher Appreciation Week, students, parents and communities are encouraged to show their appreciation for teachers in various ways. Now, this can include writing thank you notes or letters, organizing special events, presenting gifts or token of appreciation, or simply expressing verbal appreciation. You know, just going to a teacher and saying, you know, you're doing a marvelous job. Thank you very much for all the hard work that you have put in. The goal is to acknowledge the hard work, passion and impact that teachers have in the lives of their students. Now, educators often go above and beyond their regular duties to ensure the success and well-being of their teacher, of their students, sorry. Now, this is not actually a nine-to-five job. Teacher Appreciation Week provides an opportunity to recognize their efforts and express gratitude for their commitment to education. It serves as a reminder of the invaluable role that teachers play in shaping future generations and highlights the importance of supporting and valuing their contributions. Teacher Appreciation Week has its root in the efforts of educational organizations and individuals who recognize the need to acknowledge and honor the contributions of teachers. The origins of this observance can be traced back to various initiatives and historical events. The concept of appreciating teachers has a long history. Since the 19th century, there have been sporadic efforts by individuals, communities and educational institutions to recognize the work of teachers through special events, awards and gestures of appreciation. In the States, the influence of Eleanor Roosevelt, the former First Lady and human rights activist, plays a significant role in establishing a national day to recognize teachers. In 1953, she persuaded the 81st Congress to proclaim a National Teacher Day. The National Education Association, NEA, an American teachers organization, continued to promote the idea of recognizing teachers and expanded the concept of Teacher Day into Teacher Appreciation Week. The first full week of May, as I said, was designated as Teacher Appreciation Week in 1985. Now, in the United Kingdom, of course, Teacher Appreciation Day is not associated with a specific date. Instead, it is celebrated as Thank a Teacher Day or National Thank a Teacher Day, which falls on a different date each year. The date for Thank a Teacher Day is determined by the Teaching Awards Trust, a UK-based charity that organizes the Pearson National Teaching Awards. The date for Thank You Teacher Day in the UK typically varies from year to year. It is often held in June, but the exact date is announced by the Teaching Awards Trust closer to the time. The purpose of this day is again to encourage students, parents and communities to express their gratitude and appreciation for the hard work and the dedication of their teachers. To stay updated and find out the specific date for Thank a Teacher Day each year, it is recommended to visit the official website of the Teaching Awards Trust or follow their social media channels where they announce the date and provide resources for expressing appreciation to teachers. I'm going to provide the link in the description below as well so you can go and you can actually join in. And you will find the link, um, as I said, in the description. And you can encourage your child to thank a teacher through that link. Now, this year, it's going to be on the 21st of June. Now, if you go onto their website, you will also see the different ways that you can actually contribute or your child can contribute. So you can record a music video. And this is a, you know, these are the things that they mention on the thank a teacher um, website. So if you love singing, then you can please share your version of a special thank you song that you can write for your teacher, or you can, you know, buddy 
as a TikTok star. We would love to see your TikTok videos dedicated to a special teacher. Feeling creative? How about drawing um, of your teacher? You know, whatever way you can, everything. The teachers do a lot for us. We can do this much. We can just write them a letter, write them a card. We can draw them something. Um, whatever, actually. Recognizing their dedication is what is important. So teachers play a crucial role in shaping the lives of students. They invest their time, energy and expertise in educating and guiding young minds. Celebrating Teacher Appreciation Day is a way to acknowledge and honor their commitment and dedication to their profession. So Teacher Appreciation Day provides an opportunity for students, parents and communities to express gratitude and appreciation to teachers and it allows individuals to reflect on the positive impact that teachers have had on their lives and show their appreciation for the knowledge, skills and guidance teachers have imparted. So recognizing and appreciating teachers' efforts can have a positive effect on their morale and motivation. Teaching can be a challenging profession and teachers often face various demands and pressures. Celebrating Teacher Appreciation Day can actually uplift their spirits, boost their confidence and reinforce the value of their work, which can have a ripple effect on their overall job satisfaction and performance. So when teachers feel appreciated and valued, it contributes to creating a positive school culture. A supportive and appreciative environment can enhance collaboration, foster strong relationships between teachers and students, and encourage a sense of belonging and teamwork within the school community. And, you know, these are the ways that you can actually, you can just write a few lines actually for your teacher, you know, whatever way you can. So, let's do it this year and let us know how many of us actually have done it in the previous years and how many of us are thinking about doing it this year. And that's it for today's video. I'll see you in the next one. In between, if you have not subscribed yet to the channel, please do subscribe. It means a lot, but it also gives us the encouragement to make more content for you all. You can also contact us on Facebook, you can contact us on Instagram or Twitter and the QR code that you're seeing on, on the um, channel now, the QR code on the screen, you can scan that to visit our website. Okay, so that's it for today. Thank you very much. Stay well.